sick of me yet. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, I had no intent on actually doing this video until I realized that the deal that I got I had to pass on when I was at AC Moore earlier in this week. I totally forgot to get the one thing that I went to the store to get. You know how you get that way sometimes? You walk in and they be like, oh, a shiny object. No, there's all those markdown things, but I um, went to AC Moore to pick up felt and foam sheets that they had on sale, uh, the 9x12. Um, they were six for a dollar, and I walked out of the store not getting a single one. So I went back um, and picked up a whole stash of them, and I'm not even going to show them because there's everyone has seen them. Um, and I use them for die cutting, and actually um, I have a project that I'm going to do, and I'll show you how to make them stiffer. Uh, but I was walking back to the register, and I saw, and sorry about the glare, but you know it's inevitable because of the plastic. I saw the Tim Holtz Alteration Texture Fades, the little three packs. Um, and there were two of the designs that were marked at $2.75 each. And I thought, well, the regular price is $10.99, so this is pretty cool. Plus, um, for the month of January, oh my god, the reflection is just horrible. So sorry. I mean, if I turn it. No, I'm just going to leave it as is. So put your glasses on and then come back to the video. Okay, there you go. Thanks. Um, so I thought, oh, this is a pretty good deal. And I love that this is, um, there you go, Queen of Hearts. Ugh, this is going to drive me nuts. Hold on. Let me get the light off. Okay. Oh, and now it's dark. Well, to save the glare. The Queen of Hearts. Perfect for Valentine's Day. How cute will that be? So these were $2.75 each when I went up to the register and paid for them. I'm not even kidding you. I'm going to show you the actual receipt. Embossing folders. Three pack. 69 cents. Yeah. And so was the um, card one. So they were 69 cents each. Um, before you start asking me whether I can go pick you up some, which I already thought of, this was on the only two that they had on the shelf. But if you have an AC more near you, definitely stop by and check it out. And actually, if I have a chance to go tomorrow, or to stop by while I'm out and about, um, I'll check to see if maybe the others that say $10.99 are actually marked down because... These were listed at $2.75 at the end header, and it was one of those, like, uh, markdown stickers. Not on the individual item, but on the header. Um, that's what made me grab them. I would have paid the $2.75, but at $0.69 cents each, they're even better. You agree? Absolutely. So, um, and I do ATC swaps on your paper pantry, so this is just, like, fabulous. If I had gotten another set, I would have totally get, um, picked it up for you know anyone who might not have access to it and then again walking past another end header I ran into these um, half pound stacks or scraps and it's from Cam uh, Canvas Home Basics they actually do home decor and all sorts of stuff but I had picked up the Kraft um, A7 card packs um, and these are all in the Valentine's patterns and some of them are actually no I guess they're not textured but and um, they have these in the 12 by 12 sheets but these are all cut up and I think this is $2.99 for this pack and it's the half pound valentine scrap pack of the printed paper so how cute someone's already done all the cutting I'll have to just arrange them and then um, thanks to Yoli Bean I ran to Joann's, which is um, one block away from the AC Moore, and I picked up this adorable uh, Jenny Bolin um, blue ribbon punch, and I've already been playing around with it. Um, that's the mini rosette, so don't think that that's how it comes out. But th these are the punches that I punched, and actually even punched the foam. Look at that. Ooh, that was my heat. So it punches out the two little the two little legs and this so very cute I literally Yoli, I 
ran to take a shower and went to the store <laughs> after seeing your video so that's how influential that was and then while I was at Joann's um, I picked up these adorable little two packs of notebooks in the Christmas markdowns um, the two packs of the two of each design or one of each design were 97 cents so I thought those were stinking really cute uh, again, I have this thing for miniatures, and I had a 50% off coupon, so I picked up the Nestabilities um, Scallop Ovals Large, and uh, Fiskars, all their punch stuff and cutting stuff was 30% off, so I picked up another set of blades, and then in the Christmas uh, Markdown aisle, I picked up this gorgeous uh, purple velvet wired ribbon, but I picked it up uh, because there's, I think, 12 feet... Mm. Yeah, 12 feet. A nice amount. And I could totally use this on die for die cutting. And then, last but not least, um, all of the die cuts with the view stacks were 50% um, off. So the $20 ones were $9.99. But these were in the clearance aisle. And they were $7.97. I had never seen these before. And these are the dazzle stacks. And they're so shiny. And I love it. And I think there's four, four sheets of each pattern. Beautiful. Look how gorgeous this one is. It's a very, it's much thinner paper than um, ordinarily the glitter paper is, but oh, so beautiful. And then um, this pattern, green and silver. And they're not holiday specific. So, and then there's silver. So. I got all the ones that they have there, so if you're near the Manchester, Connecticut store, don't bother going. I got them all. <laughs> Sorry. But there's more stores. And then um, um, I picked up the Immortal Below, the Immortal Love, and it was like all ripped up, but it was only one of them left uh, because I want the shiny. See, like this glitter paper, you could feel the glitter. The other one is just so fine. And um, I love glitter paper, so... I picked that up because it was $9.99. And then, last but not least, is the Chateau Lavender stack. Um, I didn't know Daikatsu would have you made paper for me. My favorite color combinations. So, for those of you who haven't seen it... Oh, I just realized... Is it damaged? It was the only one, so I don't know if it's... Yeah, it looks like some of the pages are ripped. Oh, what a bummer. Well, maybe it was a return. I don't remember seeing this before. Although maybe it's a new one. But it's like my favorite color combinations of greens and lavenders. And there's even a poppy page with some epoxy and glitter. So if anybody wants a much closer look. Again, I'm doing this really quickly, sorry. Um, there's some basic. Look at the garden, like an English garden layout. Uh, music note paper, some pretty stripes. Really, really pretty strawberries. And the strawberries are kind of lilac y. Oh, how beautiful. So, yeah, um, I picked that one up too. And when I got home and showed my husband, he goes, um, Do you send suggestions in and they make them? I'm like, Yeah. Thank you, honey. You think I'm that influential, but it's the um, half with the glitter um, stack. I wonder what year it's from. It says 2011, so I don't know. I haven't been in Joann's in a while, so this may have been a Joann's uh, specific um, stack. So there you go. So if you have an AC more, um, stop by. And I swear this is going to be, I think this is my last haul for the weekend. Yes, and um, I will have a Friday fun bit. Uh, coming up later because there's something that I need to complete before I post it So it might not be until after I log off of work because I'm just taking a little quick break from work uh, to show you that So there you go uh, Exciting deals. That was pretty cool. These are really cool deals. If I find any more I will definitely pick them up if anybody's for anyone who might be interested But unfortunately there were only two on the shelf and I got one of each so there you go. If you have any questions about any of these products, please leave me a comment. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching.